This video is sponsored by Microsoft PowerPoint. I love Next Styles. Who loves Next Styles? Would it not be amazing if we had Next Style for Optic Styles? Ooh, let's try it. So I have three Next Styles set up already. I'm gonna take a look at the first one. So it's just called T1. I have it pushing in keep options into the next frame. Following T1, I have T2, so I have the three styles already set up. Now what I wanna do is in T1, add some obnoxious shading. So I'm gonna add some paragraph shading at about 20%, make those offsets about five inches, way bigger than the frame that I need. Click OK. Now I'm gonna right click to edit T2, make it just a little bit different, add that paragraph shading. Maybe we'll pick a new Creative Pro color. That one at 20%, click OK. Let me do it for T3 here. Same thing, paragraph shading. We'll change the color. We'll pick the green. Now, I'm gonna go to Gridify for text. I'm gonna click and drag with my text frame tool. Right arrow over, I have three frames. I'm just gonna copy this text in. Paste it here, oops, paste it here. Then I'm going to use an object style that I already have for these three frames, just to put that stuff in the center. Now let's do a quick little next style. Right click, next style, boom. Three different colors, so we're good there. Now if you saw my session earlier, you know that I love scripts, so I'm gonna go into scripts. I'm gonna select all three of these. I'm gonna add some points. So we'll do that from up here in my samples, JavaScript, it's going so fast, da da da, da da da. Now I'm gonna select over those, because I'm gonna point over with my select, direct select tool. How am I doing on time? Oh, plenty of time. <laughs> kind of point over to, what I now have is a list, and I want it to be a numbered list, or do I want it to be a bulleted list? Or do I want it to be both? Let's try. So in my list here, my paragraph style, I'm gonna right click, Edit that, I'm gonna apply some numbers. That goes over, I have them centered with some spacing. Then I'm gonna to go to paragraph border. Let's turn that on, but I only want the left. I want the left at about 20 point. And they're all selected and I hate that, so let me go back down to zero on this one. Deselect them, now I'm gonna make this one 20, so I just have one line over on the side. I'm gonna cap that rounded. I'm gonna drop down the top a little bit, maybe negative seven, negative nine or so for the bottom. Let's make, and link those, back to that darn link. Make this zero. Eight seconds. Eight seconds, I'm gonna turn that off, change the color, change the color to green, why not, and oh. Woo! Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to our channel. And for thousands more how-to articles and tutorials, visit our website, creativepro.com, and become a member today. Thanks for learning with us.